guys, welcome to Comfort Life channel. I am so happy to see you here today. And today we're going to talk about bottled water. Actually about three reasons that might be very important for every consumer of the bottled water. In this video I'm not going to persuade you not to drink bottled water at all, but I will share with you these three reasons which might be important for you because they really mean a lot and uh, it is so important for you and for your health and for your family to be aware of these facts. First of all, no one should assume that if your water comes from a bottle, it is uh, definitely safer and purer than regular tap water. I know it might sound surprising, but that's true. Bottled water is not necessarily safer than your tap water. So for your information, EPA is an Environmental Protection Agency, sets the standard for the drinking water provided by your public waste system. Bottled water is considered to be uh, food, so that's why FDA, which is the Food and Drug Administration, this administration sets the bottled water standards based on EPA's tap water standards. So it means that bottled and tap water, they are both safe to drink as long as they really meet these standards, but children and people with a uh, severely compromised immune system they might really have some special needs. Some bottled water is treated more than tap water, but at the same time, some bottled water is treated less or sometimes not treated at all. The reason number one that you probably need to consider is the plastic in the bottle. Almost all the consumers think that uh, the plastic itself is inert and is absolutely safe when uh, you're when you're buying a bottled water the fda has disclosed which chemicals can be used to make pet plastic the plastic that i that is used to make uh, uh bottled water but no one really knows how many chemicals are leaching into um the bottled water an environmental working group investigation actually found that the recycling code one pet plastics contain uh, chemicals, numerous manufacturing impurities, dangerous ingredients, deg degradation byproducts, and like 90 potential contaminants that may be like leaching into the water and causing the health problem. Well, it is unclear how many of these chemicals do leach from the from plastic to the bottled water, to the water that you're drinking. There have been uh, many scientific researches and studies that have shown that some of them actually can. And this is something that you need to be pretty cautious about. And this is something that should make you think that the bottled water it is not the all-in-all -all safest way to consume water. And the bottom line is that manufacturers don't usually put all the ingredients um, in there which are in their packaging and uh, the like the FDA doesn't require it. So basically it's just you, the consumer, is wondering which additives um, end up in their food and beverages and that's how sad it is. The reason number two why uh, you should not consider bottled water to be the safest and the best water source is because the purity of this water is not always guaranteed. The sometimes bottled water contains lead and contaminants and this is very important for people with a weak immune system and children. To begin with, um, some tests prove that some of the bottled water does not differ at all from what you guys are having from the regular faucet, so basically it's the tap water. Testing commissioned by Environmental Working Group in 2008 found 38 pollutants in 10 popular brands of water. These pollutants included radioactivity, bacteria, chemicals, industrial chemicals, and disinfection byproducts. Some of the chemicals have been linked to cancer and uh, blue baby syndrome, which means that really the, the tests, you know, they strongly indicate that the purity of the bottled water that we are drinking just cannot be trusted. The reason number three is to be a part of the plastic pollution solution. Not all of these plastic bottles are actually being recycled. According to EPA, we're recycling only about 30% of the pet plastic bottles, which means that another 70% is ending up somewhere else, really seriously influencing the ecosystem oceans, you know, polluting the beaches. There's been a research done and the calculation showed that about 1.6 billion pounds of plastic yearly ends up in the seas, posing a serious threat to the marine life. 
To make a very simple conclusion, we could just sum everything up and say that nobody should automatically assume that the bottled water is safer and better than regular tap water. Another thing you need to consider is that the quality of the bottled water and the quality of the tap water differs greatly from state to state. So my, I think the best recommendation for you is to do the following. You can request a copy of your city's annual quality, like water quality report, as well as the detailed independent analysis of the uh, of one of your favorite bottled water companies. And the next thing you are going to do, you will just have to compare these results and determine which product actually uh, works best for you. The annual water quality report is uh, always ready by July 1st. In one of my next videos, I'm going to share with you um, several tips, pretty easy steps, of what you should do instead of buying bottled water. I understand that the bottled water is the life savior in our everyday active you know, life and it's, it's a perfect thing during the emergency situations, but you have to understand that a bottled water costs way much more money per gallon. Only a high quality bottled water could be the best option for people with a weakened immune system. Consumers who choose to buy bottled water have to be always alert and read the labels on the bottle to make sure they get the information of what they are buying and what this water is about or whether it's just uh, a better taste or a certain method, method of treatment. And uh, in the description of this video I will put a bunch of um, links which will provide you with the like full information and all the reports. So I hope you find this information helpful because it's something that everybody must know. Thank you so much for watching this video. I wish you to be healthy and happy. I see you later. Take care.